And I'm going to check it out. What is going on here? Maybe it's like fire, maybe it's like it was done by mistake. Something like that. Something like that. Oh, just fuck. And one more behind me, actually. Yeah, it's nice vlog, actually, guys. Guys, what's a creative vibe here? It's like uh, under the bridge, some performance here, hip hop performance. Hey, guys, welcome to another vlog. So, I'm just on my way to the Woodbine Beach and Actually, it's absolutely extremely important to grab some coffee and some burgers from Tim Hortons. Yes, actually, that's what I'm going to do right now. And then it will be maybe like weekend vlog, something like that. Uh, maybe it will be two days in one day, in one vlog, actually. So, uh, welcome to another vlog and stay tuned, guys. Thank you for watching and give, give me a thumbs up if you like it. And leave your comments below under this video. If you have so many questions for me so i'm so glad to see you here again guys so guys so uh, whole week i've been working hard and i've been training hard so that's mean i deserve some grab some cheat meal some junk food here today so it's actually like it's cheat meal day baby yeah Let me give you some advice, guys. So usually, in case of going to Woodbine Beach, uh, the most people would prefer uh, stopping by taking tram, of course. Uh, the most people would prefer uh, Kingston Road uh, stop. And guys, uh, I would recommend you to use uh, next stop called uh, Woodbine, Woodbine Avenue because it's much closer to the beach and much useful to go to the beach actually yeah hey how do i look it's like beach style i think this bag is pretty cute and i like it so green yes yeah, it's, it's man's bag so i so missed for this coffee the important coffee and Tim Hartons Cafe actually is one love. What a lucky people living here, so close to the Woodbine Beach. So guys, in case of uh, having good time on the beach, on the Woodbine Beach with some kids, uh, actually I would prefer maybe to have some more space on the beach, yes? And the most of people located behind me. And it's pretty a lot of people down there. So. I would recommend you to use Woodbine Avenue stop if you are taking tram. Guys, to have in some extra space with kids, uh, this is place where I'm staying right now. It's like so close to the playground. Uh, this way, some playground down there. And it will be much more convenient for you to just have a good time here on the Woodbine Beach. guys in case you with kids i would recommend you this playground behind me and to get your kids busy that's so good place to to get it done and guys one more thing here <laughs> the smell of marijuana it's like a local fish here
right guys it's olympic swimming pool here and that's how we can find this place this is beach where we usually stay in and by the way guys you can see behind me it's like ukraine and kiev some uh, some kind of support in ukraine and it's like it, this is with Bayern beach in Toronto and this is actually also supporting ukraine and it's nice to see it here so it's time to come back home so guys after the beach we arrived to the shop this shop called no frills and actually it's a good one i can recommend you to visit it you know guys it's so similar to the walmart and it's a good one yeah. guys it's so hot outside it's like after the raining week so hot right now and actually uh, the lake the temperature of lake was around maybe like 15 degrees and it actually impressed me because i didn't know like uh, the ontario lake would be uh, so with so low temperature in the middle of the summer and after usually after, on weekend usually after the beach we, we used to we used to visit some shops making some shopping and Today we were, we were at the shop, shop uh, called No Frills. Actually, I could recommend this one. It's so similar to Walmart. And maybe right now I will show you some products. So guys, the overall price for all the stuff behind me, it's around $100. And guys, I want to show you what we actually, what we got here. It's like $100 and let's, let's do it from the right to the left. Okay, it's like some eggs here. It's French fries here, it's uh, sweet potato actually, it's a good one. This is hash brown here, and it's like hummus, I'm so like this one. is. This is almond milk and coconut. This is lactose free milk because I can drink the milk with lactose. This is, this is so cool one, this is uh, orange juice. It's like, what is consistency of this juice actually, actually it's so cool, I was so like this one. And it's like some cherries here, some fridges here, of course some chicken. And you can see the price here if you're interested in. And pizza. Some white pizza here. It's like rice, it's already prepared uh, rice and of course we've got some hot wheels for my son because without it it's absolutely impossible to go to the shop and yeah, uh, and and guys I could recommend you this one is like uh, sauce, to tomato sauce called pesto it's so like this one, you can add this for example to your rice and uh, yeah anyway oh yeah it's actually good uh, should should be so tasty if you want to try this with white pita and pesto it's it should be uh, so cool and actually this is umbrella here because without umbrella on the beach it's not healthy so you can you should use the umbrella and yeah guys it's all our stuff it's like one hundred dollars and uh, we can buy something like this maybe like once a week but usually i used to go to the shop uh, maybe like twice a month because i want to save uh, my time and not uh, i don't like to waste my time and going to the shop twice a week it's absolutely uh, normal for me and right now of course i'm like first month canada in canada and right now i'm desire to car but i used to drive car my car right now in ukraine and yeah it's like without a car in canada it's pretty hard but you can live without a car maybe if you're also going to live in downtown toronto as i live right now but actually if you live not in downtown maybe like maybe like 15 minutes away from downtown yeah it's without a car it's well it will be absolutely crazy because it's so it's not convenient to go maybe walking through the city without a car if you're not living in downtown toronto that's why we prefer to rent some apartment exactly in downtown and actually it's uh, the price uh, so similar but if, you, if you're looking for this one i don't need to use so often some public transport because of living in downtown toronto i can just walk into my job for example and it's like not so far from here to my job and yeah that's why we are renting house in an apartment exactly in downtown toronto guys give me a thumbs up 
if you like uh, when I when I'm sharing some my actually like daily routine here if you like it just give me a thumbs up and leave your comments below so I will make maybe some video much often than uh, than right now okay thank you guys stay tuned so guys welcome to my refrigerator as you can see all the stuff here on the left side and actually this is video especially for my mom for my parents don't worry guys we, we've got some food here even newcomers can buy some food here it's so affordable and yeah actually it's like american pie american apple pie here it's like some chicken pie here it's some rice with meat some healthy food of course you should buy this one regularly on a regular base you should buy some healthy food so important to you and we've got some fridges here yeah some junk food junk food but sometimes it's okay of course it's some some fish here i also recommend you guys to buy much often some fish and one more fish here so important to buy some fish guys okay guys maybe you interested what type of fish i'm buying usually so for example here it's like haddock and it's so healthy you should try it some sometimes and it's pretty affordable here price much affordable than in Ukraine, but it's like salmon here and 700 gram and actually yeah, it's also so affordable here you can buy you can buy this fish even if you're newcomers so after the cheat meal in Tim Hortons I've got this one and it's actually it's pretty healthy it's So my table was stolen by my wife and just take a look what she's got here is sweet potato some meatballs here also pesto sauce some cherries actually it's looking pretty nice and do you think after the rice with meat i can't eat more Guys, it's like American pie here and I'm hard gainer, I can eat much more than you can imagine. And actually, I, even in this case, I, I won't gain some extra weight. I know guys, it's like magic. So guys, just clean my kitchen because of, uh, it's like my area of responsibility. Because I like to prepare some food and it's much, much easier when you prepare some food to clean after you, it's like, sort of the normal in our family so yeah guys so guys after having the dinner i just want to check out how my car is selling right now because it's my car my family is for fiesta 2008 year production and i'm so i'm so like this car and i'm so used to this car and i know it's pretty cheap car maybe in your country if you live in america or in canada it's so rare to see some kind of car on the street on the road and yeah but actually it's like 60 car it's not automatic and i'm so like to drive car you know, with manual uh, manual manipulation and guys my car right now in ukraine i'm just going to sell it so it's price right now Fifty-one hundred dollar, and we'll see. I don't know actually how much I can gain uh, money from this uh, this one to sell in this, my car. But uh, yeah, guys, it's so sad to buy and this, to so to sell this car because I'm so like this one. Yeah, guys, just take a look at this car. It's my my car in Ukraine right now, selling on this side. 
you will see some I put some video of course about my car you can just take a look to this one so nice car guys I have made this video when I was in Katowice in Poland so guys usually in, on my weekend I'm making some vlogs making some video for you guys it's actually how it's looking like you can see right now it's like vlog in just for 10 minutes and you can see here how many job I got here and yeah it's my hobby but I hope you like this and give me a thumbs up if actually if you like it right now I'm making some video called Don't Down Mississauga this when we had been living in Mississauga we had been visit the Mississauga downtown and there's a video exactly about this so guys it's a fire detection right now fire alarm and yeah I'm going to check this out I'm going without my family and in this case you should use staircase not the elevator you should know it's so important to use staircase and I'm going to check it out what is going on here maybe it's like fire maybe it's like it was done by mistake. Something, something like that. Oh, just fuck. Okay, just check it. Check this out. This lock is going to be interesting. <laughs> okay, guys. I'm on my way to the street. I need to ask my manager what is going on here. Okay. Maybe it's like actually it's more, maybe it's like real fire here. Maybe, maybe it's not like fire drill. Okay. So it looks like firefighter man coming here. Okay, we'll see. This car is looking right now. And one more behind me actually. Yeah, it's nice look actually guys. So guys, as you can see it's like free fire machine here. And what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to check this out holds this building and just take a look what is going on here and my family right now in my apartment and i can't smell anything it doesn't look like it's fire maybe it's like also it's like maybe it was done by mistake maybe it's someone smelling marijuana in in apartment some snoop dog smoking marijuana in apartment and that's why fire drill fire detector was alarming here yeah, it looks like it was done by mistake, maybe. Yeah. What is going on here, guys? A lot of firemen here. So guys, a quick update here arrived. Actually, firefighter man already uh, drive out from here, and guys, uh, they didn't fight some fire here. And actually, it looks like just uh, Snoop Dogg living somewhere in an apartment in, in my building. And yeah, everything is fine, guys. It's it's pretty it's pretty cool vlogging here actually so guys so just in uh, this week i i've got a fire drill and my job and actually it was like some kind of training and i know what i should do exactly in this situation uh, don't use the elevator and actually they can they can uh, not be working and just use staircase and one more thing please if you have got some Fire uh, detection, fire alarm in your house. Uh, you should, you should, you should have already prepared some emergency backpack. Uh, I mean, you should uh, have some, maybe some uh, backpack with most important documents, maybe some passports, maybe some, I don't know, what important for you. Uh, maybe some cash and yeah, it's like maybe some documents. 
And guys, don't don't ignore, please, uh, this kind of emergency situation. In case in your house fire alarm, you should uh, grab your emergency backpack and go out from the building as quickly as possible. This is the best way in this situation. Okay, guys, take care, guys. Look, check, check this out, guys. If you want to immigrate to Canada, maybe you will live some kind of like this. It's like two bedroom apartment with den. On the first floor, it's like den. Is bad. Some living room here, and on the second floor is two bedroom actually. It's not like no one live, living here right now. It's like maybe like showroom is something like that. I want to live like this. It's like the kitchen here on the first floor. It's like townhouse actually. Yeah. Okay, guys. It looks like. I'm going to finish this uh, first day of my vlog and maybe I'm going to separate this weekend because it, first day it was pretty crazy with fire alarm and yeah, it actually it was like false alarm but it was pretty stressful actually that's why I'm going to drink some beer right now maybe you could ask me about why I'm, why I'm having in my refrigerator some beers I could answer you because of this situation like today. Okay, so I'm going to finish this vlog and today I've got some plans for today and actually I'm going to also vlog in this day. But yeah, uh, see you soon in the next one, in the next episode. Thank you for watching and bye guys. Peace.